hiked in to an old mine shaft that we found years ago and uh, we found some gold in the creek here but today we actually are going to try to find gold in the mine shaft uh, we've got the gold bug 2 we've got the uh, gold monster 1000 i packed in a uh, rock crusher and we also have some other uh, miscellaneous you know uh, hard rock mining tools so hopefully the old timers left us some gold hopefully we can find it and hopefully you guys hang out for a little bit so what do you say let's go find some gold we are going to enter the gold mine and we're going into <laughs> There's a bat right there. So we came across this quartz vein here. Wow. That looks like that could be a uh, gold bearing. And just breaks apart. Look at that. I guess they were chasing this vein right here. See mica, quartz. We got some iron. Well, I got some pyrite up here at the top. Man, this stuff is all broken in down here. This was what we wanted. Oh. Yeah, this is, I don't know if it's mined up or it's just broken up already. At least we could uh, pan right here, you know? Mm -hmm. We were walking back here and this actually fell off the wall. So we're going to try and uh, sample this material and yeah, I'm just going to do a quick pan and we've got some water back here so I'm just going to try to pan it out see if we can find any color in this right here but it looks good it just easily falls apart you can see the quartz vein right there I mean that's that's good material so hopefully we'll find gold in it now, this does look good I mean it really I know it's Oh, yeah, just doing like this. Yeah. It just easily breaks apart. I think it was so hard last time it was in the um, No? No, you're thinking about maybe Oh, that was the one in the door again. Yeah. got a micro over here. 
I'll make them a little den so I can have a little penny hole. There's a vein right there oh. Peter's digging too. That looks real dark too, man. Rusty. Yeah, very rusty. That looks really good. And all you in this. Yes. And quartz, hard quartz. You do a layer of iron. You know, get enough. <laughs> it's never enough to fill a pen. Tiny little piece of lead. Oh wow, so Peter found something over here. There is gold in the brush today. And there is one, two, so we gotta go. Oh, so my battery is dying, so I don't know how much more I can record, but uh, definitely gold is good for the... Did you get that low? Is it that one vein? One vein open here, not yeah. new, I don't know how long we go too much, because the air is kind of stiff in our here, and... Uh, but we mainly come here just to find the gold, we find it, we don't see. Okay. Good stuff, good stuff. Dude, that's, yeah, so you got that rusty vein, yes, right? Yes, 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 yes. Right there. So Peter found some gold here, and you can see that mineralization right there. More and more right here. And it's really soft, you can just break the pot. Yeah. It's easy to run. So I think we'll pan this and see if we can find some more gold. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, just look how good it looks, though. It's such good looking material. Peter found some gold right here in this rock, so I'm gonna try to break some of this down. Uh, pan it down, maybe even get the rock crusher out. But the uh, air is rough. It is getting hard to breathe in here, so we're gonna try to do this real quick and maybe come back another day and just bring some buckets and try to take some of this stuff with us. You can see just that nice layer right there on the outside. You got a good contact zone right there. Throw me the uh, rock crusher. So I think we're gonna break up some of this harder quartz right here. There we go, we'll pan this out. Here's the uh, material I just broken up with the rock crusher. So let's uh, break this down so we can find some gold. And you can see how mineralized that material is. That quartz stain just loaded down with all kinds of different minerals. Yeah. You have that yeah, it's a little micro stuff right there. There's definitely gold in that vein. But, you know, it's just a couple little micros right there in a decent little shape. That's good. That's good. I'm mean, gonna be fine. You know, the rain over there is pretty good. Yep, 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 yep. Hell yeah. That's good. But the uh, vein is so hot. Okay guys, so we are going to pack up. It is just too hard to breathe back here. And uh, we spent maybe like an hour, not much more than an hour. But we did find gold in that one vein right there. So we're going to try to come back and just bring uh, buckets and just try to carry it out and work it down there by the creek. But it definitely has gold. And Peter actually found, I mean, a stinking nice little shape. You know, you can see how jagged it is. So it is definitely, you know, coming from that vein. and. Uh, so yeah, Peter's down there. He's still trying to get some more gold. Okay guys, so we made it out and it is uh, literally a breath of fresh air. It was rough back in there. But we did find some gold. Let me hunch down here so you guys can kind of see behind me. But it is a, a nice little walk back. And we're going to uh, maybe work the creek up here next to the gold mine 
But I did find some gold and I found a tiny little specimen, so that's pretty cool. Okay, so we are out. I think we're gonna do just a few pans right here along the uh, old gold mine and just see if we can find a little bit more color. Uh oh, did you get some? Uh, I got some mushrooms. Mushrooms, okay, nice. So we got this uh, clay layer right here. A little bit of hard pack on top of it. Try to work it. I mean, we found some gold there in the cave there, which was pretty good. I didn't know how much we'd find, but we found some pretty nice little pieces. I got like a little tiny specimen. Just a little touch of quartz on a piece of gold. I see the rocks right there. Nice quartz vein. Mineralized quartz. A lot of black sand. Okay guys, so we are hiking out. And what we did today was dangerous. You know, be safe out there. Me and Peter, well, we're just a couple of rednecks that don't know any better. So stay safe and thanks for watching.